Hi, Steve Ray here with another episode of Park Bench Pittsfield. Today, we have the luxury of getting out of our office and coming up to one of the most beautiful spots in the Berkshires, let alone Pittsfield, Pontusic Lake. And today I'm here with Scott Graves from the Rusty Anchor Marina and Pub. Scott, thanks for having us up today. No, it's a great day. It's a beautiful day. So uh, Scott, tell us, what's the Rusty Anchor Marina and Pub? It's, uh, in a nutshell, it's, it's family. It's extended family. So everyone here uh, that joins, uh, it's kind of like your house on the lake. Um, everyone's on a first name basis. We cook food for each other. Uh, hence our Sunday family dinner where we all get together. Everybody brings a little something and we sit down all day and um, just have a great time and talk and cook and, and relax. Um, so it's a marina. Mar yeah, marina, you park We've your boat. we docks here. Yep, uh, docks, uh, uh, non-motorized boats, motorized boats so you don't have to have a boat. Um, we have the venue space upstairs for uh, any type of party. Um, and uh, you enjoy fishing, relaxing. That's the key thing, everyone comes here to relax. So Scott, it's often said that if you wanna get something done, ask the busiest guy in the room. Hmm. Construction business? Yep. You've been an investor? Yep, multiple real estate properties, investor, yep. A developer? Yep. You've been in the auto business? Yep. Here you are with this latest venture. Yep. What is it about the community that makes you keep investing and reinventing yourself and certainly a property like this? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm, I'm here. I'm going to stay here. I grew up here. I uh, can't help but love it. Anytime I was fortunate enough to take a vacation and go, uh, it only took 24 hours till I, I missed home. So... Uh, I decided I haven't haven't done much for vacationing because I know as soon as I go away, uh, I feel like I'm missing something. I could be doing something. I could be expanding something, helping someone. Um, so that's that's basically it. Well, if you have to come home from work every day to this, yeah, it's not the end of the world. No, no, this <laughs> yeah, this is this now, is it. I grew up here. I remember coming here as a kid from the mm. Y M when it was you know certainly the Y M C A sale club. Yeah. Um, but I remember not that long ago, and it seemed like this was falling into the water here. Yeah. It was an abandoned property. Yeah, it was uh, grossly overextended its uh, uh, limits. <laughs> so uh, we had to shorten it. Uh, sad to say, I hate shortening anything, being a, a building hugger and lover. Uh, but we had to shorten it to meet its uh, uh, weight limit, so to speak. And then... Um, started putting them back together. How long did the project take you? Happy to say uh, with a half dozen people, it was, it was three months, but it, it felt like a year. <laughs> of course, you had a little bit of advantage being in the construction business. Yeah, yep, yep. Being able to be here, be on the job, uh, be hands-on, um, that was key for me, and uh, seeing the project through to the last day. Well, tell us something about something else people wouldn't understand or wouldn't know unless they came? Well, I mean, everyone always gets uh, the third um, communication where, you know, there's miscommunication. Uh, always, I always say, go to the, get it from the horse's mouth. Uh, there are people afraid that they, you know, not just anyone can join. Uh, you have to have a boat. Um, there's just so many uh, little things that people told me. And finally, when I get a hold of them, they're like, oh, you know, uh, it's that simple. It's $99. Uh, you, you come here and you relax per person. Family memberships. We have a pontoon membership. Uh, so that way you, we let you utilize what you're actually going to use and, and not pay for something you're not going to use. That's great. So. That's great stuff. So, really, you've been in the building trades and you still mm -hmm. are. Oh, yeah. You yeah. and Paul are our building community here. Yep. And uh, I think maybe spend a minute and talk about the atmosphere up here. I know that the it's very, second very, time I came here, yeah. I ended up joining because yeah. it's very I got a relaxed. different sense. Yeah, very relaxed, family orientated. Um, 
it's everyone wants to be your friend everybody wants to get to know you you're you're not what your job is you're just you as a person um, and that's what everyone loves about this place no politics just just come and talk about what you're happy about what's going on in your life and get support we're, we're all here to support each other and in the meantime look at one of the most yeah, oh, the sunsets, scenic views yeah. The everyone, sunsets are incredible yeah, here. Yeah, everyone is can't wait to see the next sunset and photograph it and put it on their Facebook. Scott, why don't you give us a quick little tour so people can sure. get a, a feel for what's really what you've really done here? Sounds good. So uh, we're on the uh, the outside deck. Uh, it's forty by forty. Uh, we have which I don't have up is these nice uh, for shade awnings. Yeah, almost yep. like being in a little cabana. Sure. Uh, and then we put all the cushions out because of the gathering we area back in. Yeah. yeah. So we're all always close and uh, just like a family, you know. And, so what's going on here, though? Uh, I put in a, uh, a nice stainless steel countertop so we can put our platters of food that people bring. Uh, they pre-cook it elsewhere, and then we. Uh, Warm, rewarm it back up here. We have a, a little grill uh, for the, during the day if uh, till we open. We don't open till three, so some people come sneak in. They have the code. Uh, they cook a hamburger, or whatever. Lay out on the swim deck out there. Uh, walk on the thousand feet of dock we have. Do fishing um, and just relaxing. And then we uh, come in here. which is all gonna change uh, this downstairs. We're gonna do one more renovation. I keep saying that. Every year we do something, add something. We're gonna take out this wall, uh, move the bar, uh, and the bar is gonna be facing the lake the way it should be. Originally we did what we could with the budget that we had, um, and uh, it's worked for now and everyone's enjoyed it. But sure, it's, it's a great, it's some time, of the uh, time to expand. decorations you got. And memorabilia up here too. Yeah, a lot of people uh, uh, they they donate stuff which is which is awesome. Uh, they can watch stuff. a game too. Yeah, watch a game, play Kino. We come in through here uh, where this now is going to be a little bit better and more utilized dining area because the walls will be out and supported, resupported. This wall will come out. The back bar actually goes out onto the deck, and then we're going to have beautiful uh, uh, stained glass. It's one way people can't see in. You'll be able to see out. Uh, we're going to try and do uh, 54 inches by nine foot, two panels to get the view. Yep, get that view. So you've got a. And we added. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, last uh, last year we added the. Uh, Handicap accessibility for the second floor and a sprinkler system. We end up redoing over every room with paint or something, uh, some type of decor. We have our handicap bathrooms down on the first floor, uh, which we'll show you in a minute. We added three more bathrooms upstairs. We have a storage area for all our non-motorized boats back there. It's kind of a mess as usual uh, with people constantly hustling stuff in and out. Uh, but yeah, now we can take a quick peek upstairs. So what we're trying to do is match. What a great spot this is, huh? Yes, yeah, so I love this space. And that's what gives me the inspiration to want to have the downstairs more open like this and free flowing and match this bar, uh, which I can't wait to have this bar downstairs uh, with more windows. We have uh, what we call like a lounge. It's a little more relaxed space with with couches and uh, uh, we usually uh, set up food for uh, the venue up here in this room that they mingle uh, from uh, all three rooms together uh, to expand the feel. You can really enjoy yourself here. Yeah, that's, that's the key. We just want you to be who you are and, and relax. Have a great time, great view. It's just definitely a great, great place to hang out. Air conditioned too. Yes, we uh, we just added the AC to mini splits this year.
So, yep. little parties. Yep. Wedding parties. Yep. Rehearsal dinners. Yep. Showers. Yep. Anything you, anything or you, you want just to. want to hang out? Yep. Listen yeah, have, to music. Yep. Talk to friends. Exactly. The Facebook page and the website will be linked below. Scott Graves, Paula Morin, Rusty Anchor Marina and Pub, building community. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thanks, Scott. All right.